Hey, welcome back. We're gonna start cutting this gooseneck off. Um, it's pretty dang windy, so I'm probably gonna do minimal amounts of talking, which you'll probably enjoy more, and mostly working. Anywho, we're gonna cut this side with the grinder, and then for the sake of fun, we're gonna cut the other side with the plasma cutter just as a race to compare them. There are parts on both sides that will have to be plasma cut, but this vertical line right here will uh, compare side by side, so. Anyways, thanks for watching. Got a Power Max XP45 using, we're gonna see how fast it takes to cut this clean. for the wind. I don't know when the battery died, but you missed this thing almost falling on me. It would have been good to catch on video for you. Anyways, it's off. It's a pain in the butt to get through this right here. Uh, but now I gotta grind the face of this, clean it all up so we can weld that back on. We're also gonna have to grind the side that I cut with the plasma cutter. That's one downside of the plasma cutter is uh, you gotta clean up a lot afterwards. These edges that uh, we cut with the grinder though, we're pretty dang clean already. I'll just hit them lightly all the way up. I, I don't know if you saw, but I ended up having to get the oxy acetylene torch to finish cutting right here. The plasma torch would not reach in there. 